What's up guys and welcome to episode 6 of my creative club career mode with ZM Cohetes. Last episode was pretty good. German ended last episode on a really high note, scoring a hat-trick against the team we played last. I really can't remember. But we're starting this episode with a match against Espanyol. I'm going to be going all out in my first team. And we get the win, a resounding win at that. Fonteca gets a hat-trick right after German's hat-trick and, German and Helbig also gets a goal. Next up, we have Hetafe and the team is actually on really good form, but I want to rest a few of the first team players for the next match against Marseille it's going to be heavy rotation like really really heavy rotation to be honest I really don't want to do all this because I'm really struggling in the La Liga right now to try and maintain that fourth position I think I'm just going to sacrifice this match and let's just hope that this team is going to be able to get the win against Hetafe we don't we get a draw a draw is good enough then we have our Champions League match against Olympic Marseille we haven't actually used our away kits in a match before so I think this is just going to be the perfect opportunity to uh, to to showcase these kids during like open play i think i think i'm good i don't really want to make any changes and i i actually can't believe that Don that zaracho actually got to 84 before donovan because he was way lower before so we ended the last match really well it was a one goal difference because we actually came alive in the second half and we are actually in their territory right now we are in france and this is going to be way tougher than the first leg for sure but i mean i just have to be able to get ourselves out get the team out there and actually make them perform the performance of their lives for them to even reach the quarterfinals and they kick off Luis Suarez I have no idea. I don't know if that's the actual Luis Suarez or not but we do get the ball straight off the bat I'm, I'm, I'm prioritizing possession right now okay so we have a, a chance here and I have no idea what the hell I just did why did I freaking waste that why did I freaking waste that but Donovan has an opportunity here and please okay you got a header on it but it goes off for another corner thankfully and we have Donovan to target for once again please get it and the keeper saves it once again he doesn't get the ball but we can still get to Kallenberg who can shoot from here and keeper saves it and that's the end of the attack okay good interception from Donovan there and we have a chance for something here I think Stewart should be able to take this I should have given it to German but Stewart did a really good job this is the second time I'm scoring from him with in a full match and that is a really good start to the match we are we've actually been the better team they have not reached our our keeper once in this match and that's a really good goal to start this match off really good finishing from Stewart as well I mean he's 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 a one of a kind left back to be honest ah oh, crap I, I I just played it backwards but there's still a chance here and they still have the ball can we still get it no we cannot and that's the end of the attack all right so we have a counter attack here and Rise is off I don't think that he should mess this up come on and that is the second goal in the 34th minute we are ahead on aggregate now and this team has done absolutely really really good in this match to be honest that was a really good chance to stall and give it to Rise and it was a really good pass for Fonseca to be honest at, to be honest at least his passing is a lot better now I think okay I think I'm going to be focusing on getting one more goal just to solidify our place and this looks like it's going to be the perfect chance and of course German fucking misses the good ass one on one I mean I should, have, I should have probably waited before I made that shot but I have no idea what the hell is wrong with this team but they are actually really fucking up so much and look at that yet again we have possession and I think I can, I can get a show on goal here and they just keep on blocking every single freaking thing and it's half time this has been a really good first half hopefully the team does not switch off in the second half it has been a really good match and i mean let's just hope that we can hold this lead and at least add more goals to the lead all right we kick off second half with fonseca and this has been a really good match to be honest and i mean it's not over yet i mean one goal from whoops one goal from them will tie everything up and i do not i really do not want that right now i want i think a clean sheet wouldn't be that bad and that was a really good, really good pass from Fonseca to be honest to get German in. And I could have probably taken a touch or two to to stable ourselves in front of the goal. But I mean, I was in a hurry there. I didn't want anything to happen. All right, so th they are looking dangerous right now. And the best I can do is try and stop them as best as possible. And damn, that was, that was so close. That's the first chance they're having in the entire match. All right, so we have a really good chance here. And we have German and Fonseca just wasn't able to get that pass off. Oh, that was a really, that was a really good, that was a really good pass and that was a really good goal. I 
to do this, I, I I really can't complain about that because damn, they 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 tore open my defense with just that simple last move. I mean, I commented a lot of players to be pressed. I mean, like, <laughs> girl, that was fucked up. That that was crazy, and and the the patience and the compositions you need to chip keep out there. That was, I mean, I have to give them that, but. This is what I really didn't want. I didn't want them to equalize. Uh, we have we have missed a lot of opportunities. We have made a lot of chances go. And I mean, we just have to do something here. All right, so that was really good play from us. And Fonseca just... What the hell was that? I mean, come on. You can do way better than that. What the fuck was that, Fonseca? Okay, so... One thing I really don't want right now is to go to extra time. So, German, what, what what was that pass? Why was that pass even necessary at all? Just completely fucked up the entire match with just that failed pass. That was the perfect opportunity for us to go up and just like that. A couple shits. Thank you. Thank you for saying they're still with the ball. They're still with the freaking ball. God, I mean, it took you long enough. It took you fucking long enough. But we are going to extra time now. It was a, it was a good match, to be honest, bro. We just weren't able to get the final passes right, and that has cost us so much. But we're still not giving up. We have every chance to to win this match, and please, we, we have been the better team for a majority of the entire game. So please. I don't even have an idea why they are fucking up their passes so much. I mean, it's... Becoming really fucking annoying. What? What? Why? Why did that happen? Why did that have to happen? Why the hell did that actually happen? Because the keeper had that. Helbig had that. And what the fuck? That legit made no sense. That legit made no sense at all. Because we are supposed to win this match. We are supposed to win this match fair and square. I have no idea what the fuck happened there just now. That was, that was complete bullshit. Something of an opportunity here that has probably already gone, but we still have a chance for Maduke to get a really good shot and the keeper just barely saves that. Corner, I don't know if Maduke is suitable enough to take this, so I'm just going to switch, switch it to German. I'm aiming for... Please get the goal. Ugh. This keeper, this keeper is beginning to annoy me. It's begi really beginning to annoy me. Okay, so... Alright, let's try this one more time, Donovan one more time come on okay and of course it doesn't come up there but all right so we have something of a chance here and maduke might just be able to give it to fonseca and he does know i have no idea why this guy is fucking sleeping on the freaking team and i could god 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 i need i need you guys to get a goal here i mean a goal is literally all i need a goal is literally all i need come on Come on, guys, please. We have 15 in-game minutes to get the win here, and we are looking, we are looking. It's looking like we are not going to be able to get through, because, I mean, the team is just not doing what I want them to do right now. But, I mean, there's still a chance. There's still every chance that we can still win this match. And... Good. They're not even trying to get the ball. I have no idea what they are doing. They are not trying to get the ball at all. I mean, this is... Look at that. We have... We had a really good chance for a counter-attack there. And they just completely fucked it. Like, literally completely fucked that. But, I mean, there's still time for a counter-attack. If we just are able to get the ball. And, of course, we give it away as soon as we get it. I mean, what else? Okay, so if the ref gives us a chance here, we can probably run at them. And please, please, my fucking god. We did so well in the entire match, we did not deserve, did not deserve to lose this. But I mean, I blame, I blame the attackers because for some reason, they just weren't getting their passes right. The, the passes in the final third was what fucked us up completely in this match. Fucked us up completely in this match. And something we can know about it, we're out of the Champions League. The team wasn't able to overcome that match with the power of friendship. <laughs> But we will, we will eventually win the Champions League in this series. I mean, it's, it's inevitable. It's sad though, but there's really nothing that we can do. I'm just going to make a couple changes for this match against, um, I don't even remember what team that was, against Real Society. And I'm going to be simming the match, or let me play the full highlights of its attack and defense. And let's hope that we can get away. All right, so we are at that stadium where the home is going to be a tougher match than the last one. We beat them the last time out, if I'm not mistaken. And I mean, we should be able to, of course, they get a freaking penalty right off the bat. 
And which way are you going, sir? Okay, I think I'm just going to go right and yeah. That's a good save from, from Bandre, but we still have a really good opportunity. Hopefully, they don't fuck us up. I just, I just knew it. Like, I, 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 I just knew it. But that was, that was really good. That was really good for German to be able to find that pass to Kallenberg. And of course, that, that was a really good goal. Next up, we have yet another course of opportunity that the team is, that the game is most likely going to fuck up for us. And I was right. But we have Fonseca here, but the, the shots just get blocked. Turning this corner should be easy enough, right? I mean, shouldn't really be that hard. They took a shot though, and come on, come on. We just need to be able to get the ball and what the hell happened there. But they do have the free kick. And I mean, we should be able to get it out to reset. Come on, it's Donovan. Oh, that was even Lozano. And obviously that chance is gone. But we have a counter attack right off the bat. Let's see what... Okay, German looks like the most likely to give this to. So please make that run. Thank you. Who is making the support run? Nobody and we lose the opportunity. And now we have a an attack of our own. This should be this should end up in a goal. This should end up in a goal, I think. If we just work this well. And of course we don't. Of course we fucking don't. I mean it's me. It's, it's me I'm talking about right now. Of course I fucked that up. But anyway, we do win the match and that's what that's what is important and we are still most likely in fourth position. I'm not wrong, we are still in fourth position, but we are ten points clear from Valencia. That is really good for, for us. Villarreal has gone out of the Europa League of the Europa League spot and Barcelona is really close by they're actually eight points away from us which means we can actually still catch them if you win every single match from now and maybe they lose a couple matches or something like that but i mean i i'm not going to bet on it because madrid barcelona and atletico madrid are really really fucking good teams so i'm not expecting to get anywhere higher than fourth position i'm just happy that we're able to increase the gap from valencia next up our home against levante we're going to be seven minutes let's see how we do in this match and we lost the match. We actually, we actually freaking lost the match at home to Levante. That's that is fucking sad. And what is even worse is that next up we have a freaking match against Real Madrid. This is going to be so, so annoying. I'm not going to play the match. I'm going to play the full highlights. And okay, let's just change this. I have no idea why the hell this game doesn't just change their freaking kids by themselves. All right, we are at home against Real Madrid. Last time we played, they beat us 3-2. The exact carbon copy of the first match we ever played against them in this series. And hopefully, if history beats itself, this is the match where we do beat them. And I'm hoping that that actually comes true. Let's not have them have two over us in the season. And um, well, let's see what we, we, we get here. They have a solo run off the bat, obviously. I mean, it was, it was inevitable, but <sighs> Let's try and defend it as best as possible. Okay, I think he might have fucked up there. He definitely, he definitely fucked up, but I mean, it's still, it's still the game, and anything can still happen. What was that movement? What the actual hell was that movement? Okay, right now I just want. Okay, good, good. That was, that was offside. We have a solo run here for Rise, and I mean, it's looking like, it's looking like this goes be a goal because not a lot of people can catch Rise. Not a lot of people can catch him and that was really good finishing. I have no idea why it looks like that, but I mean, it got into the back of the net and that, that is exactly what matters. First goal against Real Madrid and we are looking like we might just get the win here. They have a counter-attack and let's just try and defend this as best as possible. Alright, so I thought I handled that, but I think it just goes to go out. It doesn't and what the hell. Alright, so I just go to defend this with my fucking life right now. I, 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 cannot, I cannot have them getting okay so this is good this is good it's a really good attack for Fonseca I mean he hasn't scored in quite a while I mean since that Patrick that he got in what 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 why the hell did you pass for me why why did you pass for me this game is so fucking irritating this highlights can be so freaking irritating sometimes a freaking opportunity and we have scored a, a, a bunch of these before and let's see what we can do here I'm, go I'm going to bring Kallenberg for the best chance of scoring and okay we have james we have fonseca we have german and who is this going to go to to james and please thank you thank you and we scored yet again go from the captain i'm really happy about that two notes real madrid they had nothing on us in this match i mean they had the majority of the attacks but we were able to defend every single one of them and i think this will actually get us one step closer oh no we lost our last match so if they won 
then we're just going to be back to being six points behind them that sucks now we have real betis to worry about i'm bringing in zh and batch for Rise and lucatelli respectively i'm going to be playing the attack only highlights because i want to get past this match as fast as possible so hopefully hopefully we do not lose because i mean the attack only highlights is actually a lot more tempting because you actually don't know when these bastards are going to score i'm jumping straight into the match and let's see if we're going to be able to get the win i mean we should our team is way better okay we have we have a counter attack right off the bat for Tika should be able to get this if i give it straight to him and yeah that is that is fast enough but he, he just slowed down but shouldn't shouldn't really miss from there it's for Tika we're talking about it has really good finishing and that is a really good way to start this match it's a solo run i mean i could give i could give german i could give german right there but i think i think he's just the best op option and uh, please don't don't fuck this up thank you all right, so that's three goals in this match. One for German, one for one for German, two for Fonseca, and come on. Okay, that's the end of the match. 3-1, it was a really good match, and I'm really happy that we were able to get the win here. All right, we have Brian Valicano here, but we have the match against Barcelona right after. I'm going to make a couple changes here because because I can. I'm basically putting in my my um, first, my second team, but just with a couple couple tiny changes and let's just hope that we don't win we don't lose this one i'm also just putting in van Dre because he's just the best option right there and let's hope that we can win this match and we do helvig james and cabrera get the goals for us all right this is yet another match at the top of the table it's first against fourth and let's see if we can able to finally get a win against barcelona they are the only team in this league that we have not beaten to my knowledge so this is going to be really tough i mean we have we have always drawn against them i think the first match we played in this in this se in this season we we lost I'm not sure. I really can't remember if we beat them or not. But to my knowledge, from what I remember, I feel like we lost that match. This is different. Our team is way better now. We are giving Real Madrid a run for their money. We are giving a lot of big teams a run for their money. They kick off, and I'm going to immediately press. And I just want to get the ball as fast as possible and hold possession. That's my goal in this match. All right. So we have something of an opportunity here. And please score it. Thank you. I think that is our first freaking attack and that is our first freaking goal. We are one nil up against Barcelona in the fifth minute and that is that is that is fucking crazy man. Once we got the ball from Kallenberg, I mean that was a really really good build up play and let's just hope that we can actually keep this to the end of the match. Alright, so we do get the ball and I just want to let you guys know that my my plan in this match is to actually hold possession unless it's absolutely necessary to go to go up front like like right now and i think i might have a go from here but that was that was too fucking ambitious but right, as i was saying my my goal in this match is to is to hold possession and pass them out until they literally die of exhaustion so come on come on how, how what? no this game this game is absolutely against me to be honest all right, so that was really good. We have a really good opportunity on goal here. Please score it and thank you. That is your second goal of this match and that is absolutely insane. Two goals in the first half against Barcelona. I have no idea why he didn't go to the fucking cameraman there, but that that was a really good goal and it's really it's really good that we're able to go to the up. Once Fonseca gave him and he was loose, there was no way that any of the defenders were catching him and that was a really good finish from him. Alright, that was beautiful and okay, we just weren't able to to capitalize on that. Alright, so we just have to be able to defend all this and Badri did really well in order to get that. Alright, so it's the first half over now and that has been a really good first half. This is exactly what happened in the match against Marseille and I really don't want it to be any other way right now. I just need us to be able to hold that lead and actually get more goals or hold that lead. That's really what I want right now. So, I mean, this team, I mean, they're, they're, pl they're plenty capable of, of doing that and I just want them to be able to apply their immense talents to be able to hold, hold, hold Barcelona off in this match. All right, so we have a really good chance here, but that that pass was just too wide. But we still have an opportunity for a goal here, and I mean the chance is still alive. Okay, come on, that was a foul. All right, thank you. So this is a really good chance for a goal, I think. 
because I mean we have really really good headers in our team and it should just I mean right now it's just been the most perfect time to be able to increase increase this lead. I mean I just want to put Kalenberg on it first of all so that he can give it to maybe Fonseca who's at the near post at the end right there or maybe James something like that but let's just hope that this is not too short it goes to German and well okay so that was that was really really scary defending right there and well we're able to get we're, we're able to come out on top all right so that was good and uh, let's see what we can do here that was perfect and that was that was a perfect counter attack that was a perfect counter attack and German and sorry German Kallenberg and Fonseca were the ones that were able to do really fucking well in I, I mean that was that was absolutely insane that was absolutely insane I mean the flow was really good and well I'm, I'm really proud that we are able to get three three goals up against Barcelona that that was that was really good finishing right there all right so that was straight into the keeper's arms and there might be a chance for a counter attack here but that's that that opportunity just completely completely dies down all right that was offside come on that was offside all right all right so that was really good play at the end we're able to corner them and three nil to barcelona that was really really good i really wasn't expecting that to happen at all in this match and with that i mean we just defeated the people that are first on the team which means that next season we should have a really good a really good chance to actually challenge for for the, the la liga title i mean it's going to be sure that we should be able to challenge for the la liga title and um it was a really good match. Two goals from German, one goal from Fonseca. All the goals were really, really well worked. And I really can't believe that we actually were able to get a win in, in this match. 3-0 win to Barcelona. I cannot stress that enough. And look at this. With four matches to play, we are just six points away from... Seven points away from Barcelona right now. I mean, we're not going to be able to catch them. And Real Madrid is actually drawn up points with us, but they have a match at hand, which which sucks for us. Which means that we are still we're, we're still battling with fourth and third. I mean, I I would want to finish ahead of Real Madrid. That would be fun because they did win the Premier League last sorry the La Liga last season and and all that. But this this episode is really good. The team is actually doing really really well they are, that they're kind of dead right now <laughs> but but i mean i'm really i'm really happy that they are able to do so well Fonseca is already on, a, on an 87 and donovan and zaracho have gone one up from the last time i saw their ratings so this has been a really good a really good season for us i mean next episode is going to be the season finale and i mean if you guys are are enjoying this video make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and well i will see you guys in the next video peace